welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenny if you're new and thank you so much for joining me for this summer clean and decorate. So I have all my decorations down and I'm just gonna wipe off my surfaces, get everything clean and then put my decorations out. I just love when the seasons change and I get to put out new decor that gives my neutral house a little bit of pop of color. So I hope you enjoy it as much as I do. I hope it's relaxing for you and go ahead and grab yourself a cup of coffee. I've got mine and we'll go ahead and get to decorating. Thank you so much for joining me. And I'm gonna start here in the kitchen by just spraying down my counters. Today I'm using the Method Granite Cleaner and I'm just gonna get it all cleaned off so that I can place my decor. If this is the first time you're visiting my channel, thank you so much for clicking on this video. I'm so glad you're here. And my name is Jenny and I'm a mom of three from Louisiana. And I love to do cleaning motivation videos as well as organizing and decluttering, a little bit of home decor and home projects. And my main goal is always just to inspire you, motivate you, and just make you feel a little bit better by the time you're finished the video. So if you like what you see so far, I hope you'll hit the red subscribe button and join my YouTube family. I would love to be able to see you again on a future video. And I'm gonna start with this tier tray here. I purchased this from TJ Maxx. It was $14.99, which I thought was a really good deal. Tier trays can be pretty expensive. So I had been looking for a while and when I found this, I was really happy with it. So I have a few little things that I'm gonna try to arrange on here. I have a couple of houses left over from Christmas and then these little pitchers and bowls I picked up at Hobby Lobby. And I also picked up a little sign that says family from Hobby Lobby as well, which I thought was really cute. And these were all left over from the spring shop, so they're 50% off. So honestly, like I think I paid $1.50 for the little pitcher and like a dollar maybe for some of the little bowls and maybe $2 for the family sign. So it was very affordable. And then I picked up these little lemons as well from Hobby Lobby and also this eucalyptus garland, which I just cut with the scissors to make like little clusters of eucalyptus to use as a filler. So overall, I just think this is a very affordable project to do just to kind of add some cute decor for the seasons. And I'm already looking forward to styling it for fall and for Christmas. I just think it's gonna be a really pretty piece to have. If you happen to be looking for this eucalyptus garland, it's actually in the wedding section. And the lemons were 50% off too on the little aisle that has the fruit and the vegetables. I did shop recently, but I don't know what exactly is on sale this week, but I did get most of the decor on this tray from Hobby Lobby with the exception of the two houses, which were from Target, the dollar spot. I just love the way this came out. I think it's so simple but pretty and I'm already loving this pop of yellow in my kitchen. Over here I'm just repurposing some decor that I already had for the most part. The only thing that's new is the little home sign as well as the lemons that are inside of the bowl. So I had this little pitcher with wooden spoons that I thought was really cute. I had this little bowl right here that used to have salt in it but the top broke and so I'm just adding a couple of the lemons because I bought them in a bag and then putting a little sprig of eucalyptus as well. And the little home sign is from Hobby Lobby and the tray is from Walmart from a few years back, but I do believe they still sell it. And here in the corner, again, just repurposing some things I already have. I'm just stacking a couple of cookbooks and putting a little plant. And then for my accent cabinet, I wanted to put a little bowl of lemons and a little yellow candle from Bath & Body Works. Just to, again, add another pop of color, in this case, yellow and blue. So I really like how that came out. I think it's really pretty. And over here, I'm just putting some lemon soaps that I picked up from Kirkland's and some white flowers. And here is a little look at the kitchen and how it turned out. I'm really happy with it. It's very simple, it's not cluttered or anything, and I know that I'm really gonna enjoy it. started cleaning here in the dining room with the Everspring all-purpose cleaner in the lavender scent and I'm using a microfiber cloth and I'm just gonna wipe off all my surfaces and get ready to put some more decor out. 
starting by just adding this glass vase with stems which I already had and then I've got these candlesticks I just picked up from Hobby Lobby which I'm loving these I think they're so pretty and natural looking and then I'm putting some tapered candles to add a little bit of height this little picture of Alex my 20 month old is going up along with a little bowl of lemons to add a little bit of yellow and blue and then I'm finishing it off by just adding a faux plant on top of a book and I love the way this came out. Again, it's super simple, super decluttered, and those are the kinds of looks that I enjoy the most because they bring me the most peace and calm. And here is another little tray I picked up at Hobby Lobby, and then I'm repurposing this white pitcher that I had for spring and putting some more of these white flowers that I already had inside. The flowers are from Hobby Lobby, and I had picked them up for my spring decor. And then again, another bowl of lemons. <laughs> There's bowls of lemons all over my house right now, and I'm loving the color. This candle I already had, it's a white tea and sage, and it smells amazing. So this is a little view of that corner of the dining room. And over here on these small shelves, I'm again taking advantage of the spring shop sale at Hobby Lobby, and I'm keeping out this regular decor I have, and then just adding this little gray stoneware ramekin which again was like a dollar I think, and then another little white ramekin with a lemon inside. So I'm just repurposing all this decor over the course of the dining room in the kitchen. And so I'm trying to kind of multi-use things and it also, it works really well to tie in a theme so that the house is very cohesive and the decor all goes together. And then I'm just wiping off this sideboard so that I can get some decor on here as well. The vase and the cake stand were from Spring Decor, and then I'm adding a little pitcher, a bowl of lemons, and a lemon candle. And I think it's really simple, and the candle smells so good. For the dining table, I'm keeping it super simple, just like the theme of this video, and I just took a big white bowl from my china cabinet and filled it up with a bag of the lemons and the eucalyptus sprigs. And so I'm using that just as a centerpiece and a pop of color, and I think it's really simple but really pretty. And after decorating, I made a mess all over the floor, so I decided to give the room a good sweep as well as the kitchen. I decided not to put any decor out in the family room because those surfaces are very low and my son will just get into them and it'll just drive us both crazy. So I just kept the decor in the dining room in the kitchen, which is where everything is higher and he can't get to it. So we will both enjoy it more that way. But I wanted to thank you so much for spending some time with me and allowing me to share my summer decor with you and I hope you enjoyed this video, and I cannot wait to see you on the next one. Bye, guys. Forever, forever.